warning the streamer you're about to watch comes with a lot of cringe so buckle in you're supposed to be supporting me with one gifted five dollars bro like thanks man i've been watching you for a while now it's all i can afford right now but you're you're awesome all you can afford didn't you say you were at work right now didn't you just say you were at work like bro like you can gift more you can gift more you know you, you know that right you can gift more and then only one other gifted only one other gifted comes through only one other gifted comes through like really like that's all you're gonna do is i get too gifted right off the sh uh, right off the bat of the stream too gifted that was my last five dollars i don't give a fuck it was your last five dollars like what i gave up my ramen for that <laughs> oh thank you jj that's how you support me that's how that's how you support me you give 25 anytime you come in here you know no no less than five gifted every stream 25 is how you do it that's how that's how i pay my bills and that's how i keep on streaming okay that's what y'all are gonna do now like y'all are only gonna gift me 25 subs from now on i don't care you know we have this pc goal set up for a reason we have this pc goal set up for a reason so i can get a new pc and the only way that i'm gonna get there is by using y'all's money okay now i don't even know who the hell bam gp is but it seems like he's somebody that is fishing for money because he himself is broke i will give you a news flash right now that's going to be viewed as a hot take right you ready i think a lot of these streamers that do this oh why don't you donate more why don't you sub up more why don't you do all this dsp as e begging online them motherfuckers are the real brokies out there they are broke doing this streaming shit so they get mad because they realize that they jumped the shark in, in a sense and they decided to do this whole content shit full time because they had one pretty check of five thousand dollars and they didn't really think of the long-term implication or goals so now they gotta hop online on a stream no less and e beg people who come in want to chill want to kick their feet up with their favorite content creator for eight nine hours i don't even know who this guy is but you get the point and you want to sit there and say oh why didn't you give 25 do you even know how much 25 gifted subs is and you're doing all that damn e-bagging and shit like what the fuck i see why your ass don't stream on twitch and to me this comes off like you really don't give a fuck about your community you don't really give a fuck about doing this platform shit you don't really care about doing this content shit you just look at everybody who comes in your stream your chat as a dollar sign and nothing less not a group of people that gave you a reason to sit on your ass and stream meanwhile there's people like me who's up and coming and they actually give a damn about the people who want to come in, kick with you, talk about whatever the fuck, shoot the shit. Like, talk about why is the sky purple at, I don't know, 7 o'clock on summer days. But you get the point. People like me who is very appreciative of everybody who watches videos, subscribes, and wants to have a conversation in the comment section and doesn't e-beg like a fucking broke ass bum living in a homeless box. People like me that when the day comes and we decide to take the leap of faith and go full time at least we're going to make sure we have a consistent amount of revenue to do this full time do it smart not dumb okay and for one don't nickel and dime your own fans that gave you a platform that gave you a reason to take that leap of faith up from the nine to five hamster wheel that we call a life circus into a profitable career now see i don't know if this guy just started doing youtube or what I don't know if this is his second channel and his first channel was deleted or he did something that was against TOS and got banned. I ain't gonna say banned, but got that channel deleted. So he started up a new one. And if he is, consider this snitching. For a guy with only 300 subs on YouTube and his most popular videos are just shorts and that's it. And they're clips from his stream, which I don't know if he streams on Kick and TikTok. And that's maybe how he blew up and got some type of notoriety. Go suck a dick, suck a dick, suck a motherfucking dick Suck a dick, suck a huge or small 
but he needs to humble himself very very quickly because by the looks of it you really do need them donations buddy because whatever money kick is paying you it ain't that much trust me and how many of them people that be on your kick streams actually be watching your shit and it's not a view by you jump the shark you got one good little check or you just been taking a risky move and instead of waiting till this shit pays off you're gonna like basically be doing this shit for free essentially from what it looks like because youtube don't look like it don't look like his youtube paying him at all and i don't think kick is paying him hardly anything so go ahead and deliver that mail and it's crazy a few days before halloween and this guy's already giving me the spooks but with that being said y'all let me know what you think about this guy in the comments below Till next time i'll see y'all in the next video peace